Good evening and welcome back once again. So it's finally here, the big day, the final against Barcelona in the Copa del Rey. You can see in the picture there, Sergio Busquets and uh, Carlos Perez head to head. So going to jump into the team lineups. Fingers crossed everyone's on good form. And really, really good news about the lineups. Everyone from the starting 11 that I would normally play is on form. Bar one, I suppose, I was thinking about bringing Arcas into the, the standard starting 11. He's on an orange down, but the good news is Hitch is on an, an up. That's really good. Obviously, he's going in the summer, along with the likes of Rice and Carlson. For a one-off game like this, you know, he's been around. He's done a magnificent job. He probably deserves that. I thought about playing Kavazovic because he's on an upward condition, but we're going to stick with our main centre-backs of Kosanu and Omaragic. McDowell, who had a brilliant match in the last one at right back, he's on an upward. It's going to be difficult. Just looking at their lineups. yeah, I mean... <laughs> It's scary, scary stuff. Gavi, Lewandowski, Dembele, some of the older lads, Jordi Alba, Pique, and even on the bench as well. The likes of the, the youngster Fatty, who I really like. He'll be, I would love to sign him eventually. Rujo, the young centre back. Anyway, let's jump in. And here it is, the final of the Copa del Rey. I still don't understand about the stadium with the Copa del Rey. I, I know the final is uh, a neutral ground. That makes sense, but all of the other matches were as well. And this is a bit of a strange stadium to pick as the final. I don't know too much about the Copa del Rey. It looks like a relatively small stadium. But let's forget about that. I mean, look at that lineup of Barcelona. Scary stuff. I was surprised there was a there was a couple of omissions from their squad that weren't even on the bench. I could see that they were in the sort of reserves. Some strange choices. But still a very, very, very strong starting eleven. And tall. I mean that team looks very tall compared to ours. Can he be man of the match? Can he be the game changer? His performances have certainly been a little bit better as of recently. And Xerxes, key as always, holding up the ball, playing out wide. Can he get in the score sheet? Vieira, our captain, who's arguably, arguably, you know, play of the season for ourselves. Actually, now that look at the stadium, it is a big stadium. I don't know if it was the first shot. It didn't. It looked like quite a small stadium, but um, oh, here it is. And we're playing in our home kit. We did change Barcelona to the the black kit, just for the clash. And we want to play it carefully in the first 10 minutes or so. If you remember when we played Real Madrid and then Villarreal, because we're used to playing Division 2 teams, the sudden jump up can hit you pretty fast, pretty hard. Oof, nearly got caught out there. See what I mean? So you can see, nice ball to Herrera. Now Hitch. Mudrick, always excited when he's on the ball. Oh, Xerxes, he was just underneath it. Perez couldn't quite get there. And of course, they're going to want to play out from the back. And they're going to do it well because all of their players are going to be good passers of the ball. Will be hard. I was going to say hard pressed. Hard pressed to press them. Um, good block there. Oh, we get the throw somehow. Must have came off a double hit. Came off their player. Nice pull through to Xerxes, and he takes it well. Plays it through to Perez. Mudrick. Oh, it deflects that hit Xerxes. I'm not sure where that came off. I suppose it doesn't really matter in a way, apart from that, you know, whether we'll get a goal kick or a corner. No, maybe it was the Barcelona player. Not sure. No, it was Xerxes. Ah, unlucky. Just couldn't get out of the way. And they're going to play it long, which I'm surprised at. 
I have got Lewandowski though. He was uh, pretty good in the air. Roger getting forward here. Now Herrera. Vieira. Oh, I deflected again. Play it simple, play it simple. Don't take any risks at the back. Nice ball out wide to McDowell. He was really good in the last match. Yeah, through to Xerxes. Oh, just over hit slightly. It's pretty even so far. In fact, I would say we're maybe the better team at the moment. Just so wary about them hitting us on the counter, though. Xerxes. Oh, he's offside. I knew it. I tried to pull out of the pass. It's too late. 68% possession for ourselves so far. Nice interception there. Uh, Xerxes not going to be strong or quick enough there. Uh, just caught him. A bit over eager to, to get in there. Okay, this is fairly positive so far. I'm happy. Just need to keep concentrating. Don't want any bad luck. Oh, Modric's in here. God, Christian is a lot quicker than I remember him being. Yeah, there's that thing about the speed in this game which is broken, I think, sometimes. <laughs> nice interception. Play it simple, nicely done. Kundi, yeah, intercepts it. That wasn't the best of passes. I read exactly what I was trying to do there. Need to be careful. Oh, this isn't looking good. Good clearance there. Good block. Throwing bodies at it there. But it was all because I brought Kosanu out. I don't know where he came from. And that left a gap. Playing it short. PK getting in there. That was a chance. Certainly their best best chance so far. Nicely played. Carlos Perez in here. Carlos Perez. Ah, oh, straight at the keeper, no power. Couldn't get my feet out from underneath it to curl it round, so try to use the side foot. Near Xerxes. Now Mudrick, what's going on here? Mudrick! And he scored! Barcelona were all over the place. I don't really know what happened there. But the right side of the defence was just... Yes, yeah, so the header... Yeah, just that, that quick pass from Vieira to Xerxes just broke the whole defence. And I just had to stay calm, which was uh, easier said than done. Nice pass from Xerxes. Difficult pass when your back's to goal. Just got it strong enough. And Mudrik, what did we say? Can he, can he do it in the final on the big stage? Well, the answer to that is yes so far. Big moment right towards the end of the first half as well. I'm just going to try not be too clever. Uh, <laughs> we'll get a bit of fortune there. Oh, 
Pereira through to Mudrick. Ball nicely taken. Couldn't quite get up to full speed. Now Vieira. Oh, good save. Oh, changed my play at the wrong time. Good tackle, but they get lucky there. Oh, wide. Oh, that was the last chance of the half. That would have been a bit of a killer blow right at the end. 1-0 though. Absolutely brilliant. And yeah, 56% possession. They had three shots all off target. They did have a couple of chances, obviously, that one right at the end. PK with the header. They look dangerous, which is something we would expect. But uh, getting the majority of the possession, I'm, I'm surprised that. Really good first half. That's about as best as I could expect. We just need to be very careful not make any stupid mistakes. And they've already made a substitution. Which um, I'm not surprised that they didn't have their the best of halves. Certain nice tackle by Cossonu, but they get it back straight away. And that's the difference with these top, top players. The speed at which they, they get up after a tackle is, is quite ridiculous. Um, sometimes physics defying, I think. But as you can see, that's a poor ball. Poor ball had it was one on one Mudrick with uh Oh could be in danger here. Great tackle from Kosanu. And just getting rid of it. And it's actually a good ball to Xerxes. Uh, and he doesn't hold it up. I don't know where this gets came from. Nice interception, but give it away. Hitch with a good tackle. Nicely intercepted from uh, Herrera. Now Xerxes. Mudrick. Mudrick in again here. Mudrick. Oh, it's just wide. I saw the keep off his line and try to chip him. It was the right decision. I don't know what Testegen was doing, actually. There was a defender there. Oh. Just a bit unlucky there. It was did all the right things, the right decisions, just slightly off target. It just it was agonizingly wide. Good tackle there. And Herrera bringing it forward. Got an overload on this left hand side here. And that's Oh actually is 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 a good ball in the end. Mudrick now. Oh, straight at the keeper. Mudrick's back on form though. He's the player so far. He's the one that's creating all the, the chances, the danger. Lovely header out by, I think it was McDowell there. Just let it go out. And um, we're going to have a look to see if we need to make some subs. Okay, so uh, we're doing this live. I think we're going to bring on Berger for Carlos Perez. Carlos Perez hasn't been massively in the match. It's mainly been down the left with Mudrick. Fabio Vieira. Do I really want to take these guys off? I think actually we'll bring Harrington on for Fabio Vieira. And the rest we're going to leave as is. Yeah, going to leave it like that. But Vieira and Perez have done a good job. Every player has done their bit so far. But need to keep going for the 90 plus minutes. 93 minutes or whatever it's going to be in the end. Nice ball from Mudrick there. Lovely out. Oh, that's got to be a foul, is it? Is it not? Get it clear. He was off balance. Oh. That could have gone anywhere. Now if they play it short, I'd prefer that actually... Oh, well, I say that, and then... Uh, got to wave it a little bit there. Nice ball. Somehow missed all my players. Well over, though. 
you know what, we're just going to launch this. I think playing it short's not the best idea. Xerxes does get on the end of it. Bit of space here for Tashera. Mudrick, good block. Could be in here though. Mbjer is in. Oh, poor touch. Really, really poor first touch. Good interception. Mudrick. That could be going out, and it is. We've got them rattled. I mean, we're going to be the players are going to be shattered after this match because they are just chasing them down every time, which you need to do. And that's a little bit too long, but Mudrick gets in. Mudrick, ah, straight at the keeper. Ah, should I have played it across? I'm not sure. Let's hope we don't live to regret that. Good tackle there. Don't care if I give away a foul. We needed to do that. I mean, I thought I got the ball, but I did take most of the player as well. Oh, goodness. That was uh, interesting. I can see Mudrick free here on the left. Ah, but they just spot exactly what I'm going to do, but I've still got a bit of space. Now Herrera... Nicely out wide to, to share it. Of course, some tired bodies now as well. You can't expect Madrid to be doing as much running as he was before. Now Xerxes. Nicely through to Herrera. Oh, what a save. That was the best move of the match, though. Played it across to the left. To the right, sorry. And then back to the middle. Lovely little flick from Xerxes. He does that so well. Good save. Now, they've got some... Big lads in the box, so do we really want to play it in? Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, yeah, there's acres of space for Lewandowski here. We'll get it back. I'm just going to play it back to the keeper. Let's just keep the ball for two seconds. So we'll reset a little bit. Nice ball, Herrera. Really nice ball, Herrera. Oh, I couldn't quite play it across. I don't know how it actually got blocked. Now, Herrera. Harrington. Oh, blocked. Of course it is. Playing it safe there, not taking any risks. But Mudrik is... Uh, Texera, sorry, he is free on the left. Uh, maybe shouldn't have went for that. Maybe a one last chance for Barcelona. Crunch and tackle. Good save. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's 92 minutes and they've got a free kick. Oh no. <laughs> oh. oh, I don't know what to say. But the free kicks for the AI are very overpowered. I've faced quite a few free kicks in those sort of areas and they actually score more often than they don't. I try to bring the keeper over by holding triangle, I know you can do that. I've tried putting players on the line before and that doesn't seem to work. I mean, great free kick. Oh, uh, literally the last kick of the game. Well, there's the 90 minutes up. We're going to be going to extra time. And just look, a quick look at the stats. Possession, yeah, I'm still ahead, but I'm good. So I've had to change things up. Just Xerxes is flat out. Um, I brought on Castle Dean for him. I'm actually going to put Bajer up top as a second striker. Or maybe Harrington because he's a bit stronger. Yeah, I'm going to do that. 
It's not ideal what I would do. I would have bought an Orca Speed on the Downward Orange, and that's going to make a massive difference. Extra time. You couldn't write it. 90 second minute equaliser. Oh, that's a foul and a half, that was. As long as he's not injured, I'm fine with that. That's not who I was trying to pass to. But hampton has got a bit of space now. Now Oh, well, it was a bit of a strange decision, but it worked for them. Now Mudrick, now Hampton. Really need Mudrick to make it run, and he has, and that's a beautiful ball from Hampton. Oh. Hampton! Oh, good save again. Oh my god. What a ball that was from Hampton to Mudrick, and I just couldn't. Yeah, he's so tired now, Mudrick. He just couldn't run away. And then a couple more chances and a good save. Um. Let's try Castledean taking this one. <laughs> Share with the very acrobatic attempt. God, I hope this doesn't go to penalties. Nicely out to uh, Mudrick. Oh, it's offside. Yeah. Mm. It's the tired legs mainly at the moment that's um, having the impact. We rely a lot on, not rely on pace, but. You know, we do need that. Good tackle. And he has Cassadine. Is there anyone else up there? Not really at the moment. Is that not a foul? No, apparently got the ball. Good tackle, but we don't get any luck. Good clearance to Mudrick. Oh, unlucky. Oh, that's a foul. Mudrick out wide. Can he get onto it? Just no pace there. No. Half time in extra time. Oh, my drug's absolutely flat out here. But there's Hampton. Oh, that's a poor ball. That's just tired legs, isn't it? What a tackle from Hitch. Thunderous tackle. Mudrick through the oh, again. Is that a free kick to us? I think it is, you know. I'm terrible at free kicks, though. And... Should we... They had about seven plays in the wall. I didn't think it was... I should, maybe should have went for it, but I wouldn't have scored it. That's the thing. Here's Hampton. I don't know how that wasn't a foul. Here's Hampton. Hampton again. That's a foul. Is that a penalty? Is that a penalty? That's got to be a penalty, isn't it? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, no. Right, let's try and play this. Mudrig, and there it is. Oh, my God. Oh, they were so worried about the free kick. It was just too close to even take a free kick there. Mudrick with eight gets a space. He's got nothing left in the tank, but brilliant shot. Wow. Five minutes left, just over. 
just clear it. God, to share, it can't even run. Oh, a chance here. Cossonu closed them down, though. He probably should have went on and ran because we've got nothing in the tank with most of our players. And Harriton making it tricky for the defenders. He's doing well. Mudrick, he's on a hat trick now. Oh, and he closes him down. Waste a bit of time. Good tackle. Oh no, not another free kick. Oh no. No, 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 no. Hang on. Oh, you've got... I don't know what to do about these free kicks. That is absolutely ridiculous. I was trying to bring my player back, as you could see, but they wouldn't let me do it. Look. Ugh. Oh, my God. This is going to penalties, isn't it? I don't know what that was. Just tired legs. Mudrick now. Out wide to Castle Dean. Oh, what is going on? Ugh, this is stressful. Oh. Yeah, we'll look at the stats later, but penalty shootout, oh my god. I have not got good penalty takers down the line. Oh, Mudrick, please. Oh, I decided to go down the middle, and that's not worked at all. Oh, no. Dembele. And why is my player moved there? Oh no. Ugh. Good save. Come on, Schubert. We have to score though, no doubt about it. Oh, it's wide. Oh no. This is not the way I want to go. Uh, this is it. Need to score this. Rolls it in the corner. But if Barcelona score, that's it. Come on, Schubert. Oh, that's it. Oh, what an effort. What an effort from the team, though. A really good game. I'm being biased, obviously, but I think we deserve to win that. I mean, two free kicks from them. Both at the end of the game. You know, one in 90 minutes and one in 120 minutes. Don't think we deserve that at all. Lemdowski got my of the match. Not surprised with the two free kicks, but... Mudrik, for me, was the star of the show. Everyone played their part, everyone was brilliant, and we're just to get beaten by Barcelona, to take them two free kicks and then penalty shoot out goes to show how far we've come. But yeah, absolutely gutted. Uh, just looks absolutely gutting to see that on the bottom left, two two penalty kicks. Like I said, we didn't have very good penalty kick takers, but my decision to play it down the middle of Mudrik was poor. Should have aimed for the corners with one of our best penalty kick takers. 
and that was maybe the difference in the end. Brilliant match, though. I'll look back on that and say, do you know what? You know, we've played the best team in, in Spain and we've pushed them to the limit. We're going to get promoted. We've won the league. We've got to the final of the Copa del Rey and only lost it on penalty shutout. So I shouldn't be too disappointed in the end, but I just really feel like we deserve to win that. Ah, oh, what a gutting way to end the uh, the cup run there. Brilliant performance from the lads, though. Couldn't fault any of them, really. But once again, thank you very much for joining. Please hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Comment down below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all the videos. Thank you very much once again. I'll see you all next time. Cheers.